Hello, everybody. This is a brief video to help get you started in this course, to get you oriented to the way the course is laid out. Let me note that the demonstration course in this video may not look exactly like the particular course that you are taking, but that is okay. The same general principles of uh, course navigation apply no matter which section you're in. So first things first, how do you get started? Well, if this is your first time ever into the class, what you want to do is scroll down here uh, to week one where it says introduction and orientation. Click on there and follow the instructions laid out for you. But let's say it's just a typical week in the class um, and, and you're trying to figure out what you need to do this week. Well, please note that the entire semester is laid out for you in this course web page week by week every single week of the course is already laid out for you all the way down to the final exam so once you figure that out now all you need to know is well what's what's the date where are we so what i mean by that is in this case let's just say for instance hypothetically it's week four you want to work on week number four all you've got to do is scroll down through the course website to week number four there it is and click on the very first link discussion because when you click on this link you will see pretty much everything you need for that particular week of the course laid out for you a brief introductory video a list of the things you need to do that week and here's an important thing each task in this list will have the instructions attached to it. And what that means is you don't have to go searching somewhere else to find the instructions, right? So each task will have instructions and in some cases an example bundled right along with it, all right? And then if you scroll down a little further, you'll see what's called an essential question. This is the big question that we're working on each week. Uh, beneath the essential question, you will see sources. What are sources? Well, basically, this is the assigned reading. Here's how you find it. Um, the textbook, you'll see the textbook reading listed here, and make sure you pay attention to that. Um, and then below the text assigned textbook reading, you will see links to the primary sources and the supplementary resources. So please note that the, the only thing you need to buy for this class um, in terms of reading is the textbook, right? The primary sources and the supplementary resources are linked for you. So in this case, all you've got to do is click on them and they will come up for you. Um, and then if you scroll down to the very bottom, you will find the discussion forum itself. And that's important because this is how you will be turning in all of your work for the class week by week is right here in the discussion forum, right? This, com this class is completely paperless and this is where you turn your work in. So hopefully this has given you a sense of how to get started, where to find stuff. But of course, do not hesitate to drop me an email if you have any questions or concerns about the class. I will be more than happy to get back to you. I'm pretty good about um, contacting people immediately. In fact, um, I'd actually prefer if you texted me, and here's the number to text me at, um, email is a little slower. But either way, drop me a question if you got them. I will be happy to he hear from you, and I'll get back to you as quickly as I can. I'm looking forward to the course. Um, good luck with it. Let's get going.